back to 1,000 or 1,200? I mean, cut it back to 800? I mean, if she Well, there is a certain amount of travel that needs to be done to keep up certain certifications. Don't put it real close to 900. Bring it up to 900. I would suggest leaving it in at 1,000 dollars, cutting that to 50%. 1,000? You know, with fuel going up and everything, just to have it on. The books that we buy, is this certification books or is this books for like, uh, and I know that she's purchased a couple of books for me being a new county commissioner. Does that, does that come from this fund or does that come from a... Yes, sir, and some of that is membership. There's a couple of HR memberships that I have for the Travel, um, <coughs> again, I expect that to be a hot topic all day long. Current year, you spent $1,265, and then again, we're budgeting $2,000. Would that, would that be an issue that maybe we could bring down to $1,500 from $2,000 to $1,500? Communication, is that C-O-M-M, this thing? Yes. Um, what are we spending on communication that would come out of his budget for a $23,000 budget when we current year spent $17,007? That would be another area of concern for me. Is that his phone, cell phone, just No, that ain't his. Well? He pays for some tea. Is all that coming out of his budget rather than split up between the different departments where it's actually coming from? The cell phones are split up in different departments, so that's not. <coughs> Explain line 54101 as communications. T1 line. T1 line. My, my question, Malcolm.
three to five percent, but it can be as much as ten. And we've always had a cushion there just in case on the reason to get part of the back end. I knew what the increase was that we get from our internet, I would I would feel better, but that's where my concern is. If they give us a ten percent increase Exactly. And again, it seems like I'm the only one asking questions. If I'm out of line, somebody needs to speak up. Tell me. Yeah. 
since July. In the last four years, we haven't spent $23,000 a year combined. In fact, it's gone down two years this year, about a year up $1,000 the end of the year to current year, which you're going to have two months still yet to go. And that's $6,000 that's more. Do you think you're going to spend $6,000 between now and the end of the year on that line? Is my question. The life will probably spend three at least. So. But I don't know that this, this month. P1 bills you come out of that number. I don't know how current the number you're looking at. Like the there may be three months worth of P1 lines that come out of this. I don't I'm going to go back to my original question. If we reduce that $1,000, I thought I answered that. From 23 to 22. Is that agreed? Even the now, something we can do. Something we can do is we've had a backup DSL line ever since we lost our DS, our T1 line since the hurricane in Louisiana. Eighty nine dollars a month. When's the last time we used it? We haven't used it since. Okay. Times is hard. And I don't want to tell you how to run the business. I've suggested to kill it several times, and I've always been told no. You demand and charge that. It's coming out of your budget. You're responsible for your budget. I work for y'all, and when I get told no, I'm done. This is the man you work for right here. All right. The question is, I understand it. Can you 